late start to the vlog, but that does not mean it's a late start to the day. Um, about to head over to the studio. Got to pack up for a video shoot that I got to do later today for a dance workshop. And then I'm heading over to, um, before that, I'll be heading over to a meeting with Leonard in St. Paul, I think. I got to check the address. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, uh, I'm done here at the studio. I'm gonna head over to our meeting. So, I got the wrong address. Let's try this again. I think there's a slight chance that that parking ramp I was in is definitely like a drug front for uh, laundering money because what parking ramp takes only cash? It's the first I've ever seen that. I've seen only card, but never only cash. Maybe I just need to get out more. I need to do a better job of familiarizing myself with downtown St. Paul. I have no idea where I am, but I think I'm in the right direction now. I need to have meetings with Leonard more often. He just uh, bought me lunch. <laughs> All right, whole fan restaurant. Meeting's over, it's time to head back to Woodbury. And uh, we got this video shoot for the dance workshop that I gotta get to right now. The temptation to stay down here and play Pokemon all afternoon was real, but let me get out of here. Got places to be. I was far too overdressed for filming a dance workshop. So I changed back into polo and shorts. Now I'm ready to get down there. Yeah. I think we just made an infomercial for bubbles or yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Into their fancy outfits now. Oh, okay. Oh, Come these on. weren't fancy? I guess not. No. <laughs> <laughs> and so I want to do one. Should I wear my dress? Yes. Popping bubbles. I already have a good one from you though. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I just finished a uh, dance workshop with these Woo! dancers. I was teaching them how to dance, so if you want to see some of my, my great choreo- oh, Why are you laughing? <laughs> my, my great choreography is there. Just kidding. I did it. Woo! Yay, Brene! Yeah! <laughs> they like her. <laughs> I was so far away you can't really see what those guys are doing but they are playing cricket which is one sport that I have no idea how it works like not at all if I had more time I'd go and ask them maybe they could teach me 